How about that sunshine? Yeah, amen. Finally. Um, 45 years ago, in September of 1963, President John F. Kennedy undertook his conservation tour, visiting communities across America to rally the nation to protect the environment. He began that historic conservation tour right here in Milford, the birthplace of the American conservation movement, where he dedicated Gray Towers and the founding of the Pinchot Institute for Conservation Studies. On that autumn day, the President said, there is no more fitting place to begin a journey across the United States to mobilize the attention of this country so that we in the 1960s can do our task in preparing America for all the generations which are still yet to come. There is no more impressive place to begin that journey than here, in this town, in this place, in this state of Pennsylvania. Today, we are deeply honored to welcome another member of the Kennedy family on a mission to mobilize the attention of the country so that we, in these early years of the 21st century, can do our task to prepare America for all the generations which are yet to come. Rory Kennedy is one of the most important documentary filmmakers of our time. Her work inspires and motivates people around the globe to combat poverty and sexism and racism and the AIDS epidemic and other compelling challenges of our time. Her most recent film, The Ghosts of Abu Ghraib, examined the Abu Ghraib torture and prisoner abuse scandal. Today, she shares with us why she is supporting Senator Obama's campaign. The journey to the White House has already been a long one, but today it begins anew, and there is no more better place to begin that journey than here in this town, in this place, in this state of Pennsylvania, in this hour and at this moment. I'm very proud to introduce to you one of my personal heroes, Rory Elizabeth Catherine Kennedy.